children in well, it's a dangerous world they live in, isn't it? Even though they have magic and all of that, it's still a very dangerous world. You can't escape it. It's not perfect. And so, yeah, so she would always have been, is a scary, frightened for her children and very protective of them. And for Harry, who's a surrogate son. Okay. Do one quick stop here. What was it like bringing out your inner action hero for the final part of Deathly Hallows 2? You're doing what? Bringing out your inner action hero. My bringing out my inner action. What action does that mean? What you call your wand? Oh, my inner action hero. You saw the movie just now, and you were fabulous. <laughs> my wand arm. It's much bigger than the other arm because I wand so much with it. But um, <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, my inner action hero. It was always there. She always was an action hero, Mrs. Weasley. But she was cool. So she just she just brings the action hero out when she needs to. You know. Thanks. How has it How has it been seeing the trio grow up throughout the film? That's lovely. It's, well, it's not a unique experience. I can't imagine anything else that that would ever happen in, apart from a soap opera. And this is very different from that. So it was extraordinary. Yes, it makes you feel very close to them. Okay, you know. great. Um